y'all good morning and welcome back this week's vlog is going to be in all things last first week of college if that makes sense i'm entering my last semester um, of college here at florida state so i am up staying with my sister actually in my old apartment which is kind of funny um, with all of her new roommates because I just have to be up here for an orientation week um, because I have two classes left which they are allowing me to do online and an internship which I'm actually doing back at Arnold Palmer Hospital in Orlando. So I am just up here for a week of, I don't really know what they're going to have us do for a week here but I thought I would take you along in my last week here at Florida State in all things syllabus week, going out with friends, and all of that. Okay, I thought I'd set you up and give you a little first, last first day of school outfit. Um, I went very casual because it's going to rain and I'm just sitting in a classroom but I also don't have to be in scrubs because we're not doing anything like sim lab or any of that. Also, I guess I should kind of tell you for all of you who don't know, I am in nursing school here at Florida State in my last semester, as I mentioned. So normally, like the classes I have left aren't really like actual like content classes. They're more of like, um, one of them is leadership, kind of like teaching you how to like apply for jobs and stuff like that, like the um, interviewing process and all of that stuff. So kind of getting you prepared. So I'm done with all my content classes and like my sim lab. So now it's just like working and getting experience in the hospital. So I will be wearing, I normally have like a scrub uniform that I wear. So today we're just in a casual t-shirt, t-shirt, lol, sweatshirts and just converse, but I think it's gonna rain and I have to walk to class because normally, like the last few years, I have like a little Vespa suitor that I ride around and that's already at home. Um, when I moved out, I brought that back home. So I have to walk to class and I don't have an umbrella. So I might get a little wet, but yeah, a little outfit check. We are back after our first few <laughs> classes. Um, I guess they weren't really classes, but like orientation. The first one was fairly short. It was only like 30 minutes. They just went over like their expectations and whatnot for our preceptorship. And then our other one was this like 160 question test, which was very sabotage of them because my brain is still on summer vacation and I was not ready to answer all those questions, but we made it through and now we are on the way to Trader Joe's to do some grocery shopping just to get some like basic essential things to get me through the week so I don't have to eat out for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And then I think that's really it. I don't think we have anything else planned for tonight. Hang out, make some dinner, maybe drink some wine, watch a movie, play some board games. Nothing exciting. How was your first day? Don't show me on camera right now. <laughs> <laughs> I okay. literally look awful. Wait, this is Madison's roommate, Hi. Macy. Macy. How was your first day? <laughs> so good. I had one class that lasted like 30 minutes. <laughs> we all survived yeah, our first know. day. This is
Okay, I'm gonna give you a little Trader Joe's grocery haul of like the essential things that I need to survive in a week. So to start out, we have just some salami and cheese, just as like a little snack with some carrots and hummus. Um, for breakfast wise, I did like bagels with cream cheese, some yogurt, and then little go macro bars to take like on the go to class with me. For lunch, I just grabbed two little pre-made salads because it was easy and then that bag of salad. Um, I grabbed just like a green juice to have in the morning and then of course, coffee and creamer, a must. I also grabbed just some apples for on the go and then something to make dinner tonight. I did some fried rice, some veggie rolls and then some pot stickers for Madison and I. Um, pickles, of course, a great snack. And then a little charcuterie setup with just a few cheeses, some crackers, and some wine. And then, of course, if you go to Trader Joe's, you have to get flowers just because treat yourself. Wait, do we have a bag? Okay, here is the final product. Um, I may have burnt Madison's. Let's flip it over so she doesn't see. Not the best looking presentation, but still yummy. Good morning and happy Tuesday. Um, I started my morning off with a little workout class and then came back and made myself from breakfast, as you saw. Um, I'm just going to check my computer for a few minutes to make sure I don't have any work that I need to submit or like any attendance, anything that I need to submit. And then I have my first class today at 10.15 but it really isn't in a class. It's just one of those like standardized tests again. And then that's all I really have for the day. So I think I'm just gonna run some errands and get some things in order. Currently on my little walk to class. It's about like 20 minutes, not bad from the apartment. I'm taking a little shortcut through the, ah, stepping in dirt through parking lot. I don't know why it took me so long to say that. I'm going to see if I can set you up here and show you my little outfit of the day, but it looks like I'm going to be 30 minutes early, so I'm going to have to figure out something to do. Oh gosh, you can't really see. Oh, okay. I have a little workout set on, a little white tank top, and then this pink little skirt. You could see it when I was making breakfast. But today I actually have class at the College of Nursing, which is cool. One little last time going in there to see it. I'll see if I can show you around. I'm not really sure if they want me videoing in there. I don't know, but I'll definitely be able to show you the outside. It's kind of on the end of campus. So I get to walk through the middle of campus, which is nice. It's pretty, a lot of brick as you can see behind me older brick buildings but still very pretty there she is oh it's a little loud in here let me see i am back from class having a little cheese crackers carrot hummus snack for lunch and we'll probably just hang here watch some tv Maybe some YouTube before and chill. I actually have a doctor's appointment that I have to go to. Can't forget that. And then just hang out and chill before we get ready to go out tonight.
<laughs> Madison's um, doing her online classes. Mm-hmm. And then we will have some fun. Okay, I have decided to be um, a nice sister. Actually, there's someone out in the hall. And go pick up some packages for Madison and down in the lobby because she is out returning something from Amazon. So, oh gosh. There was a person, I got scared. But she doesn't even know what she ordered. So, I'm thinking maybe we do a little unboxing <laughs> for her. Okay, packages secure. Um, the first one is pretty self-explanatory. It came like this. It's a gigantic, gigantic fan. So I'm guessing she just wants her room to be cooler. But considering this is from Amazon and it came like this, I think they opened it. And then same with this one. Cover up her address. It's completely open and they like taped it. So that is a little suspect. Let's see what it is. Well, considering <laughs> what <laughs> a thing of Mexican candy, Madison. What in the world? That is so bizarre. I don't know what she plans on doing with this. Okay, I just came out of CVS. I went to their um, little minute clinic because for nursing school. We have certain things that we have to be like compliant with and one of them is an annual tb test which i guess is just to see you never know what you're exposed to in the hospital so just to make sure that you don't get exposed to it but i was going to show you one here but it's kind of hard to see hold on you can see that little they just barely put it underneath your skin and put like whatever that the fluid is underneath and it creates that bubble but then I guess within like 48 hours afterwards, I come back and I get it red, which they just look at it and it'll be flat. It'll be like nothing there, which means you're negative. And I guess if you have like a reaction or something, then you're positive. So I just had to get that done quick. And then I also stopped and got a new deodorant, a natural one, because I have the um, Old Spice one, the Fiji one that like everyone is getting burned by or something, the chemical burns from it. And mine's almost gone. I used the whole thing and I didn't have a reaction, but one of my good friends did. So I'm like, okay, rather not take the risk of that happening. Um, and so they re recommended this one. And I guess this is a new scent. I don't know. It's not good. And then a dry shampoo because I forgot to bring one up here with me. And I was using Madison's roommate. And I was like, I just need to get my own. I am going to make us little drinks have while we're getting ready because that's just more fun while Madison makes herself some food. Hello. You can't have Join the vlog segment. Do you want a drink? Oh. <laughs> a slicked back pony tonight because it is storming and my hair does not stand a chance against humidity um this lighting is also terrible so you can't even see what my makeup looks like but now it's time to pick out an outfit which is always the hardest part and just take a peep at my suitcase sorry madison it just is a disaster so we have to figure out what we're wearing out of that after many outfit changes 
this is what we ended up going with this little corset top and some jean shorts because it is very hot outside and then just the classic gold necklaces rings bracelets my shoes actually maybe you can see them in this mirror I zoom out I just went with some Nike blazers cute but it's raining outside so they're gonna be destroyed we're unintentionally matching right now all the way down to the same shoes Good morning. Oh my god. Don't mind my appearance. I literally just rolled out of bed. It's like 7.15 and I'm walking to class right now because I have one of those standard eyes. Oh my god. I literally, I look like I'm bald from this angle. It's weird seeing campus so empty like this. Normally this is like land of screen and it's full of people either playing games, sitting in the grass, walking around, and not a single soul right now. Madison and I are out and about going on a little campus walk to find, actually no, we know where it is. Hold on, I'm trying to cross the road here. Um, the student union to check it out and to get out of the apartment because we're bored. to take a little break to share our student union experience y'all that thing is crazy it is so big and they showed us everything like told us everything that was going to be in it but like when you see it for the first time you're like whoa we have a huge like brand new bookstore with just like everything you could think of they have what were the food places that they have um Panera Bread Starbucks Polo, Tropical, and some like pizza place, pizza places. And then they're like, a lot of it is still under, oh, there's fun. A lot of it is still under construction. So like they're gonna have, I think they said like a Chipotle, a sports lounge. Um, they have a bowling alley and like a pool room, which I thought was so cool. Um, and then the coolest thing, I didn't get a video. I was scared that she was gonna be like, why the heck are you videoing me? But they have this big grand piano in the middle that anyone can play and some girl was playing on it and you can like hear it throughout the whole entire student union which was so freaking cool. I thought that was so cool. Um, and then I kind of gave you just like a little campus tour. Oh God, a tree. Um, nothing too intense, just little clips as we were walking by. They are about to leave for dinner. We got ready really quick. I am just wearing this little Zara skirt. Looks like a little skirt in the front, but the back are shorts. And then this cute little top. I just left my let my hair air dry, so it's just gonna be a little wild. But that is okay. And then I forgot to bring normal shoes with me. So I am rocking the Converse with this fit, which is kind of cute. Makes it a little, dresses it down a little. Which, I mean, we're not going to the most fancy place. We're just going to get um, some sushi and then probably to that wine bar after. We made it. It's Masa. Cute little restaurant. Just outside. What? 
like a food on And this outside. is why people think we're twins because <laughs> look at me. He's wearing the same skirt that I am. Oh, say less. <laughs> <laughs> Town <laughs> with the two girlies. We are going to Madison Social for one casual drink. One? <laughs> one <laughs> that's that's what we all say, you know. It starts out, oh my god, my hair right now, what is going on? It starts out as one casual and later next thing you know we're walking in the apartment at 1 a.m. But Madison has an 8 a.m. tomorrow, so she doesn't want to stay out right late. There. And I have an orange shirt class in the morning, so I don't really want to stay out late either. So, we shall see. Wait, you're not having brother all i can do is laugh what did i what did i like oh god what am i doing um i told y'all last night i was like this happens to us every single time i need to be better at the self-control apparently one drink turns into too many um that's basically what happened last night we went there to have a glass of wine because madison's roommate macy is doing their like um weekly challenge or whatever i think it's like nine drinks ten something maybe i don't know and you cross them all off and then you get like this cute free shirt i've never done it i don't know why i haven't done it with how much we end up spending there might as well get the free shirt out of it but we went there for one drink so she can cross one of them off the list. And we left having way too many. At one point we thought the bartender was giving us a shot. And then he was like, oh, the guy across the bar in the pink shirt bought you shots. It's like this six-year-old man. And we're like, oh my gracious, what is going on? Um, but honestly, we got home at like 11. So not the worst case scenario, not going to lie. And now, I'm here, oh, you can't really see, at Orange Theory, because I thought it was a smart idea to schedule myself a 7.30 workout this morning. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> so, we're just going to go in, get that done real quick, and come back, and probably, I will say, I will probably go back to sleep this time. Um... I had just have like an orientation today, so nothing crazy. Oh, and then I have to go get my TB test read, which I wish I could send a picture because there's literally nothing on my arm right now. So having to go all the way there for that is kind of sucks, but whatever. Okay, we are braving the rain to walk and get some Chipotle. It's literally, you can see it right there, right across the street from my apartment, our old apartment, I should say, which was very dangerous for us. Spent way too, money, too much money at Chipotle. But I didn't buy enough groceries to make meals that night, so. Chipotle it is. Oh my God, those people just honked at me, stop. But Chipotle order. I do the salad, because I like, Actually, she filled it up pretty well. I like more lettuce on mine, but I do white rice, both beans, a little bit of the medium salsa because it's too tomato-y. Mild, you mean? Oh yeah, mild. And then medium with sour cream, corn, cheese. And she forgot to put the guac on there. Mm -hmm. And I forgot to get a side of vinaigrette. I really failed. But I'll just yeah. put this hot sauce and then, you know, my obsession with Coke Zero. Are you a, um, put it in the bowl with the lid on top and shake? 
or a mixer type of vibe. Or some people, I guess, get scared by mixing it at all. I don't mix one. See, ew, you have to mix. You need a little bit of everything in your bite. But I only mix like a, a section at a time. Wait, y'all, please look at this wall. <laughs> It looks so bad on camera, dude. It probably looks worse. All <laughs> oh, the polka dots. Oh, no. I don't know if you remember. Oh, no, drop in the comments if you know. <laughs> Any recommendations on how to get these oil stains off the wall? It's from, you can see, the blue, like the putty or whatever that was on the wall. You saw earlier in the beginning how we had that huge wall piece up with the lights but they wanted to redo the decor a little, and so we pulled it down, but that's what stain left on the wall. And it looks whack. <laughs> a little Dairy Queen stop to get some ice cream. A must, yum. Hi, can I do a small blizzard in, with Oreos and cookie dough? Um, can I do a small blizzard with M&M's? Sorry, a small M&M's? Yes, please. Yeah. What else? That's it. Thank you. Mom hates when we do this because she says we're cheating on our ice cream shop. But unless she's going to um, ship us up some ice cream real quick, you just got to do it sometimes. <laughs> Cheers. Oreo and cookie dough is always the way to go. <laughs> mm. Yum. Fire. So there are not many M&Ms. That's kind of disappointing. Really? Mm -hmm. mm. I got a guest to come with me today. It's orange theory. Although she was not accepting my 7.30, so we had to do 8.45. But still, workout partner. Important part. Feeling pain? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I didn't know that was a high five. A good little kickstart to the weekend. Sweating out some fluid to make room for some more. <laughs> Um, but actually, I think I might end this vlog here and pick up another one tonight when we go to the block party and start all of, like, game day festivities. But depending on how much footage I get this weekend, you might see it after this. So, if not, tune into the next video. I think they get.